Love your neighbor as you love yourself. Do to others as you would have them do to you. Just as you did it for one of the least of these brothers or sisters of mine, you did it for me. When social workers have clients that need everything from beds to sofas to chairs to linens to kitchen furnishings and lamps, Ruth organizes all of us into what we would call a makeover visit. For these makeover visits, a team of volunteers use our Gracing Spaces truck for the larger items and their own personal vehicles for smaller items. The team of about 35 to 40 people gather on a Saturday morning at about 8.30 and Ruth assigns each into teams. These teams load, deliver, and then place the furnishings in each of the homes we make over. The work continues until the homes are completely furnished and we try to finish by early afternoon. Social workers stay with us throughout the day at each of the homes. They're there mainly to coordinate with the families. The need for assistance continues to grow. In 2016, Gracing Spaces served 388 families and individuals. This number reached 534 in 2017. This level of effort depends heavily on a steady stream of donations and dedicated volunteers. These volunteers donate more than 10,000 hours of their time each year. When I joined the church a few years ago, I heard about the depot. I said, what is that? And they showed me the 17,000 square feet of in materials to put a homeless person in their first apartment. I said, sign me up. And I've been here every Wednesday since then. I participate in Gracing Spaces uh, after walking in one day and seeing what was here, that we go out and we help people that need furniture, that need whatever. We put together a bed that we know that night somebody is going to be sleeping on. On the makeovers that we do for families, that we go out and actually furnish a, uh, an apartment, we go into an empty apartment, when we leave, it's completely furnished. And at the end, when toys come in for the children, we know that we have done something to benefit a family in need. Gracing Spaces is about sharing love and spreading joy. Help is always welcome to receive and organize donations on Wednesday mornings, as well as to load and transport furnishings to new homes during monthly Saturday morning makeovers. Continued donations from a generous community, coupled with our volunteer workforce, will ensure the future of Lord of Life's Gracing Spaces ministry. People always ask, when will our mission be done? Oh, that's easy to answer, when everybody has a home. 